what's up guys, Sawyer here from Techie Grad. So if you haven't seen our video last week about the card folio case from Doc Artisan for the Galaxy S7 and S7 Edge, go check that out, I'll leave a link in the description. But those cases were one of the best that I've seen for the Galaxy S7 series, and today we're going to be taking a look at another Doc Artisan S7 case. This one is the Sport Wallet, and I think it's a really good case as well, so here's everything you need to know. So just a couple quick things to note about this case before we get into the full review. On Doc Artisan's website, this is labeled as the fifth generation of the Sport Wallet case, but this is actually the first one that they've made for an Android phone. The first four were made for iPhones, but don't be fooled by that, Doc Artisan is not new to the case making industry. Another thing to know is that the last case we looked at, the Cardfolio, was available for both the Galaxy S7 and the S7 Edge. However, the Sport Wallet is only available for the S7 Edge. I'm not really sure why, but that's just the way it is, so if you have an S7, sorry, but you can't get this case. There's three different colors of this case available, and in this video, we're going to be looking at the black and dark brown wallets. But there's also one that has a lighter brown color. The types of leather used on these cases varies from color to color as well. The dark brown case has softer, smoother leather that will scratch up over time if that's the look you're going for, while the black case has more textured, shiny leather. It's really just up to what you personally want. From the stitching to the feel of the leather, it's immediately apparent that Doc Artisan is trying to produce a high quality product, and that's probably why this case costs $90. Yeah, $90, let's talk about that. So the odds are is that you've never bought a case for $90 before, and it's going to take a lot of convincing for you to buy one for $90. So as nice as it is to hear me talk about how great this case is and see some camera shots of it, I think that for a lot of people, once they actually buy this case and get it in their hands, and they feel the experience that Doc Artisan is trying to give you and the build quality that they bring, they won't look back one time. So let's get back to the case itself though. When you open it up, you pull off a band that's holding everything together. There's a bit of magnetic tension that it takes to remove, which is not only really satisfying, but also offers a lot of functionality. However, when you're actually using your phone, there isn't an actual place to put the flap and it just kind of gets in the way. You can sort of fold everything around the phone, but when you do it, it just seems really bad for the case, so I tended not to do that. But the best part of this case is that the shell that your phone sits in can be removed from the wallet itself. It's held to the wall with magnets, and it's actually a lot stronger than you think. You can definitely trust putting your phone in and expecting it not to fall out. On the other side of the case, there's a ton of different places to hold your cards and money. There's four credit card slots and two money pouches, but I found that each credit card slot can hold two cards if necessary, but you may stretch out the pocket. As for money, the case is just a tiny bit too short to fit the entire bill in, so you have to fold them in half. Besides the price, there's really only one other con I had with this case, and that's thinness, or lack thereof. Especially when you have cards and money in the case, the wallet can be twice as thick as the phone itself. But Doc Artisan does make it so you can remove the wallet, but then you end up asking yourself why you bought the case in the first place if you're always just going to leave the wallet at home. Really what it comes down to is two questions that you have to ask yourself. The first one is if you're willing to pay $90 for a case, and the second one is if you're willing to carry around a thick case. If you answered yes to these two questions, you'll really enjoy having this case. But if not, something like the Cardfolio is probably a better case for you. So that's really going to wrap up our review of the Sport Wallet case from Doc Artisan. If you like this video, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for more content from TechieGrad. And as always, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.